Hey guys, Paul Barter from Best Bin Custom Props, the Rebel Armoury Forum, FX Sabres, Best Bin Custom Props on YouTube obviously because you're watching it. Um, this is a quick install I did on a UK customer by the name of Will. Um, sent me a Sabre Full Jasp, I think it is. I don't know if that's the type of Sabre that they are or whether that's the actual design of it, I don't know. Don't generally deal with them if I can help it. Um, basically, it was a stunt saber when he sent it to me. He'd already ripped the guts out of it, and I well, chucked in a nano biscuit version four. He went with a um, royal blue, blue, white main LED. Um, asked for light meat sound font, which obviously is on their stock. It's also got the um, Graphlex 4 and the last Graphlex and I did a um, put on and change the boot sound on light font for him as well um, so what I did for this saber is I machined cut a thread to put the recharge socket I want to learn the ways of the force and become a Jedi like my father and the activation button is there 16mm which I got from um, the saber armory what it has inside is a chassis that um, found on Shapeways. I didn't design the chassis for this one. It comes from one of the shops on there. I forget what shop it is offhand. And it's just a basic chassis, but it was able to fit a 28mm base speaker. And the SD card is just there, so if he wants to um, try messing with it himself, changing sound fonts or whatever, then he can. So it's easy to access. The other thing I did was I put rubber O-rings on the sabre here and here because none of this lines up. It's like the cover tech was over here somewhere and the buttons are around here and this is over there. So now it all lines up. You've got the line lining up. You've got the cover tech underneath lining up. It's all nice and straight now. And the other good thing about these is because they're rubber, when you tighten them down, it actually grips it and helps to stop it from coming loose. So if he does any dueling with it, hopefully it should help to stop that from happening. So I'll just get a blade and do a quick demo on the blade. Where's the Allen key? It's around here somewhere. At least I thought it was. Perhaps it isn't. So it's a nice colour blue. This isn't a heavy duty blade, this is just a standard blade that's on this one. That's light meat. This is the weapon of a Jedi Knight. Last Graphlex. So as you can tell, the sensitivity is really good, and that is straight out of the box with this um, soundboard. I didn't touch the sensitivity on it at all, when it's spot on. I mean, these nano boards are really something now, um, compared to like previous versions. The these are really great now, in terms of sensitivity compared to, to the old um, version of them. So yeah, so uh, I'm sure there was something else I was going to say, but it slipped my mind. But yeah, so 
Yeah, we have it. Thanks for watching, guys.